everyone! Welcome back to another Pokemon card opening video. Now, if you've seen what's in front of me, then you probably realize this isn't going to be my usual Pokemon card opening. This is a mystery box. I decided to go out on limb because everything that's been going on has put me way behind on videos. And I figured you, just, you guys deserve something for all the waiting you do. I don't like you guys waiting, that's for sure. <laughs> and I think we've done enough just hearing me talk. Let's see what we actually get this time. Now, I've done the street boxes before on the channel. And the result was interesting, to say the least. I don't want to flip this around because i got the address on the other side. And I don't exactly know how to blur it out on my camera. Okay, that wasn't coming open anytime soon, so I'm going to be resorting to something I don't want to use. A box cover. Kids, don't try this at home without a grown-up. They can be very sharp. Da, 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 da. Okay. So first off in our mystery box, we got a Ripple Clash booster, along with a whole bunch of mystery cards. The first being our. I'm hoping this is the Hollow Swallow from Breakpoint or break through. Ah. I think it's break through. I don't have too many, so I'll have to look up the symbol later. Also, another little pack here, which includes sleeves and a hollow Pokekiss Ancient Traits card, which I tend to think of as a half card. I guess these are kind of like freebies. Oh, and we got a couple older packs here. Steam Seed and Fates Collide. Not too bad. Not really anything anyone's looking for, so... Don't know if I'll hold on to these or open them. I'll decide in a minute. Oh, and... We've got a whole deck here, it looks like. Probably from one of the... Packs. I'll have to go through these. And then we've got a little padded one here. Now, if I remember, I'm guaranteed with this guy one PSA graded card. So, shall we open it up and see? And why do they have foam peanuts? Huh? I think I might actually get two this time. The first one is actually not too bad. A mysterious fossil trainer card. Well, from Fossil, first edition, too. It's a seven, though, so I don't know how much it would be worth. PSA graded, so still good either way. I'll have to. I wonder what made it. Get a seven. Well, besides the speck of dirt, probably it's faded. The next one, also from Fossil, a Gem Mint 9 First Edition Zubat. That's not too bad either. I don't have any PSA cards at all, so I'm happy just getting anything, even if it is common cards. <laughs> Plus, again, you can't really find these anymore. Not unless you're super lucky. As for why Zubat's only got a 9, I have to assume besides the little speck in the corner here. Sorry, let's move out the fossil one. It's also not quite centered. Seems like it's just a teeny bit skinnier on the left. Not too bad, though. And like I said, these are old, so just... Getting anything in that condition is 
amazing. Now, I think I'll start with our little mystery packs here. What do you think? There goes Space Collide. And we'll put this over here in what I'm going to call my recycle pile, which should have get, gotten clean up after the last episode. Okay, we'll start with Swellows. And it looks like we even get a free sleeve. Mm, looks like Swallow must be the best because it's already in a penny sleeve. Although I'd like it if it were not so miscut. I mean, you see at the top how skinny it is and the right thick. Well, still, if I don't have it in my collection, then I'm not going to worry too much. Next, we have Pokemon Ranger from Steam Siege. At least I think it's Steam Siege. It could be Ancient Origins. i got to remember what it looks like. Counter Game from Lost Thunder. I don't think I have that. Then we got Pokemon Capture from Sun and Moon Base Set. Escape Rope, I think that's either Crimson Invasion or Burning Shadows. I'm gonna have to double check again. Or if you guys wanna look it up on your own, there's the symbol. I'll make sure to say in each case what it is. Now from Fates Collide, Alakazam Spirit Link. <laughs> well, we got two. Captivating Pokepath. Do I have this one? I'm not sure either. A full heal? Plenty of those. And then, okay. <laughs> this one I may want to get graded. A first edition energy charge from Neo Days for sure. I just don't know if this is Neo Destiny or a different one. I'll say in subtitles what it is, or you guys, if you're not wanting to wait, you can look it up here. Make sure to pause the video. That explains the sleeve, actually. It's a rare, too, so I may want to think about getting this sent off for grading. By the way, I'm going to need a new box for... Well, <laughs> just PSA cards. <laughs> Move this out of the way so it doesn't bend anything else. Considering what we just found in that one, I may save the other one for last. And open up our Rebel Clash. Okay? I mean, why do I always tear it up so badly? code card. How's it looking, guys? I don't want to see what the color is. One, two, three, four. And we've got Darkness Energy, Heat More, Zatu. How many did I get in that booster box worth? Tranquil. We got Meditite, Milsiri, Growlithe, Impidimp, Funnel B, and then reverse Funnel B. What's behind it? One, two, three, and Alcremi, Alcremi, regular rare. Well, nice cooldown. I don't know if I want to open my Steam Siege and Fates Collide this episode. Not with everything we've got here. <laughs> I mean, I've got Toga Kiss right here to open. So let's get to it. I'm like, how do I want to do this? They've got Toga Kisses cards sleeved up nicely. 
making sure that's the only one in there. <laughs> I've seen Ando's video where he's gotten two in the same sleeve, mostly to hide it. This one's kind of miscut again, though. Not as bad as previously. Anyway, we also got Armored Fossil Shield on, Claw Fossil Anorith, Gardevoir Spirit Link. They all seem to be from the same set this time. Another Pokemon Ranger. Shield Dawn's Fossil again. <laughs> Another Ranger. Another Shield Dawn. And another Ranger. Let me send some in here. And one, two, three. From Evolutions. A reverse Charmander. I don't know if I have this one. Or at least not as a reverse. I'll have to double check later. <laughs> I guess that means we got a good one earlier. <laughs> oh boy. Now, question is, should I open this little theme deck here? If that's even what it is? I think I will. I can even get it open. Hey. And I think these are all just going to be common cards from, like I said, Evolutions. Yeah, these are all just common Evolution cards, it looks like, or the most maybe uncommon. Never mind, scratch that. I found a another breakthrough card. It's the Quad Blue. And Voltor, Togepi, Shuppet, Fero, Fero, Halo, Electric. Yeah, like I said, we're going into a different set here. And once again, new set. I think that's breakthrough. Don't think I have vanilla, so I'm gonna be going through some of these pretty slowly. Okay. Definitely don't think I have Star Me. And Gapada. And now we're on to Base Collide, <laughs> which I have a bunch of. Including Chaos Tower, I believe. Still not bad to have all of these. At least if you're trying to set up the deck, you're all set. And I think after that, I'll just go to the recap. Okay, this turned out to be a way better opening than I thought. Even though I haven't opened two boosters that I got in this mystery box. <laughs> I'll save those for probably another video. Today, our mystery box contained from our rares, or the rarest ones anyway. We got the Ancient Traits Hollow Swallow, an Ancient Traits Togekiss Hollow, Ancient Hollow. Then, oh boy, from whichever set this is, I will have said it already earlier in the video. One of the that's Energy Charge Trainer. Okay. And not to mention our first edition Zubat Mid 9 and the Near Mint 7 first edition Mysterious Fossil. Hi! I'm like, what's the best way to show these off? Preferably without doing any damage. And I definitely need to do a PSA grading for this one. I haven't done that yet, but it's probably about time. At least for some of my rarer cards. And if you like this video, want to see me do more mystery boxes, make sure to hit the like button. Or just tell me in the comments. 
Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. And as always, I'm your host, Christina, signing off.